So if you want to accept Jesus in your heart right now, please say this prayer with me. Just repeat after me. The most important thing is that you mean it in your heart. So here we go. Dear Jesus, I confess that I am a sinner. I believe that you shed your blood on the cross for my sins and you rose on the third day. I open the door of my heart and I ask you to come in and be my Lord and Savior. I'm sorry for my sins, Jesus. I can't do this without you. I open my heart and I ask you to come in now, Lord. Please forgive me of my sins. In Jesus' name, amen. It's as simple as that, you guys. If you just confess with your heart, I mean, confess with your mouth and believe in your heart that Jesus Christ is Lord, then you shall be saved. So it's just a matter of surrendering and opening your heart and letting Jesus in, confessing your sins to him and give, giving him your heart. So if you said that prayer, I want to welcome you to the kingdom of God. And I feel led right now. Um, to continue praying. So, dear Heavenly Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, I lift up whoever is watching this on the other side of the screen, Lord God. This person has just given their heart to you, Lord, and I just ask that you touch them right now in the name of Jesus. Please fill them up with your Holy Spirit and baptize them in the Holy Ghost right now. I come against any evil demons and Satan himself right now in the name of Jesus. I bind you, I rebuke you, and I command you out of their life right now in Jesus' mighty name. Leave! Flee, never to return again. In, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, I command every evil spirit and Satan off of your life right now in Jesus' mighty name. I command you to loose him now in Jesus' name. Loose her now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Leave their life right now in Jesus' name with the authority invested in me that God has given me in the name of Jesus. As this person has confessed their sins to Jesus and opened the door of their heart to Jesus, you have no legal ground here in the name of Jesus. So I command you out in Jesus' mighty name. And I declare and decree freedom over your life right now in Jesus' name. Freedom in the name of Jesus. Receive your free gift of salvation and receive your um, baptism of the Holy Ghost right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, I ask you send your warring angels, your warrior angels over this person right now in Jesus' mighty name. Lead them and guide them in your Holy Spirit, Lord God. And I declare and decree that you are washed in the blood of the Lamb. In Jesus' mighty name, you are forgiven. You have been given a robe of righteousness. You are free. And who the Son sets free is free indeed. In Jesus' name. So go in Jesus' name and receive your freedom right now. I love you and Jesus Christ loves you more. Keep calling on him in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name, may this prayer bless you. In Jesus' name, amen. Not by might nor by power, but God's Holy Spirit. In Jesus' mighty name. So don't look at me. This has nothing to do with me. This is all God and His Holy Spirit. It says, these signs shall follow those who believe in Him. It says, they will cast out demons in His name. They will lay their hands on the sick and they shall be healed. If they drink anything poisonous, it will not harm them. And they can pick up snakes with safety in the name of Jesus. And it says in His word that He comes to set the captives free in Jesus' mighty name. So this is all God and His love for you. So receive your free gift of freedom, salvation, healing in the name of Jesus. I declare healing over you in Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. May you go and be blessed in Jesus' name. Amen.